My family had my back, and I was ready to get to work. Junior surprised everybody by setting up a call with Stacey Abrams. Hello, Dre. I'm so happy to be talking to you today about mail-in voting. What? I thought we were talking about my campaign. I may have lied to both of you, but since we're here and the data's free, <laughs> I don't see why we both can't get what we want out of this call. Okay, look, Stacey Abrams, I'm running for Congress. I want to change the system, but I'm not sure where to start. Running for office is a lot of work, mostly fundraising. To beat the big money you're up against, you'll need community support. Knock on doors, talk at churches and union meetings. And that'll be enough? Oh, definitely not. So I can't imagine you pulling it off. I was looking for more of a pep talk. Um, you've lost weight? Well, thank you, Stacey Abrams. Wait a second. How would you know? We just met. I don't need to know you to tell you that we need everyone to vote early. The important thing is making sure your voice is heard this November. Oh, that is not a problem for him. He is a very loud man. Don't you embarrass me in front of Stacey Abrams, boy! Hey, Stacey Abrams, can I get an endorsement? Sorry, Georgia Earthquake. Rumble, 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 rumble. B best of luck. After getting Stacey Abrams' implicit endorsement, I decided to follow her advice and hit the streets. Oh, look at the cute little widow baby with the... Ow! I'm Janine Greenstein. I just wanted to talk to you about <clears throat> Drake Johnson for Congress. Huh, that kind of worked. Get up, Janine. We've got 30 more houses to hit. I landed on a cactus. Look, I'm not afraid to answer that question, Desus and Miro. When I'm in office, my term is going to be about making the tough calls. So here we go. Garlic Parmesan, Cajun, and number one is lemon pepper. Hold up, my guy. Buffalo doesn't even crack the top three in your wing ranking? Are you serious? Nope, not for me. I'm losing my mind right now. I respect that. That's bull. But are you a ranch or are you a blue cheese kind of dude? Um... Say blue cheese, you'll look like an elitist. If you say ranch, the voters will know you're pandering. How are you going to get out of this one, Dad? You know, I get both. I like to dip the drumettes in the ranch and the flats in the blue. Much like America, I believe in a blending of flavors. Yes! Spoken like a true man of the people, Dre. You got my vote, man. I got a vote for him as well. Then the hologram of Biggie hugs the hologram of Tupac. Then they both introduce Kendrick Lamar, who introduces me. Do we have the budget for that? We have the budget for... a poster! <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't my enemy. I noticed you've been making some headway, but I've got just the thing for that. Andre Johnson has over a hundred pairs of shoes. What's he running from? Can we trust a man who still lives with his parents? Face it, Andre Johnson is out of his depth, and he can't even swim. Paid for by the powerful friends of Leslie Stevens. <laughs> Outstanding. Notes, anybody? Can we make it race baitier? We'll save the race baiting stuff for social media pudding. You can't hear that. Thank you. Not until you switch the last photo to black and white and slow zoom on his mouth to make him look scarier. Whose side are you on? I'm on the side of becoming Secretary of Transportation. Gonna finally get my Celica out the pack.